Hello, I'm IBX Toycat, and you might recall that recently Microsoft bought Mojang for a really significant amount of money, and they said that their reasoning behind doing it was that they didn't want to mess up the PC version or the PS4 version or anything like that. They just wanted to own a successful property as well as get Minecraft going on Windows Phone, because currently uh, Minecraft Pocket Edition is only available on Android and iOS. Uh, we didn't actually hear anything about the Windows Phone thing until just yesterday uh, from one of the Pocket Edition developers. So Thomas Chechi, or at Tom C. Uh, who's one of the big developers on the Pocket Edition, uh, basically tweeted out this image saying, by the way, here's another reason we've been pretty busy working on 0.10. So if you don't know, that's a Nokia Lumia, and it's running Windows Phone uh, 8, I believe, and uh, basically if you look in the middle there, that's Minecraft Pocket Edition. So they've confirmed that Minecraft Pocket Edition for Windows Phone is coming, and it's coming even sooner than we'd expect with the next big Pocket Edition update, which is called 0.10. So Minecraft for Windows Phone is confirmed. Uh, is there anything too exciting about this? Well, if you're in the 3% of people that own Windows Phone, that's awesome news for you, of course. You can now play the Pocket Edition. Yay, Minecraft on the go. Uh, if you're not on the Windows Phone, then it means a little bit of a delay to 0.10, which is, you know, not too great. But honestly, besides that, it doesn't mean a whole bunch of Minecraft on the other systems or Minecraft Pocket Edition on the other systems, because it just means another version of Minecraft is coming out, it's delaying the first update by a little bit, and then it's just going to be another version of Minecraft you can get. And with Windows Phone, slowly, very, very slowly, slowly growing its, uh, you know, share of the uh, market. Maybe your next phone will be a Windows phone, so maybe you'll appreciate this when that comes out. So, uh, yeah, that's Windows phone coming out with Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.10.0. So let's talk a little bit more about 0.10.0, because I haven't made a Pocket Edition news video in quite a while. I like to try and cover them all in major stuff, and there's been quite a few uh, kind of images uh, tweeted out of the thing showing uh, what's been going on with it. So uh, let's start with uh, their boats thing. So uh, they confirmed they've kind of got boats working with this screenshot, where they're actually using the minecart model still, and I I just thought that was pretty uh, amusing. Uh, I, w I wish on the Pocket Edition minecarts were just doublers boats. In fact, I wish in all editions that work. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, boats are working, but he said, uh, Thomas Chechi, the same guy, has said that they might not be in 0.10 because they, he wants them to work entirely properly. Uh, I don't think boats work properly on any edition, but that's a nice thought anyway. So next up, we have a little bit of news on the Minecraft Pocket Edition swamps. So basically, uh, they made them more swampy, in uh, Thomas, uh, Thomas's words. And as you can see here, are two screenshots of, uh, you know, the swamp stuff, and as you can see, it's not too bad. It's just uh, it's a more green swamp, and it, it gives the swamp more of char uh, character, and that's always a good thing. So more characteristically swampy swamps, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Uh, next up, we have a graphic bug fix, which uh, you know just kind of shows you the lighting is kind of working even at a distance. And look how beautiful this sunset. Is. So besides a little bit of a fix to the way the sunsets work and that sort of thing, what else is actually coming in Pocket Edition 0.10 that we've seen so far? So first of all, we have these above ground. Uh, abandoned mine shafts. I think this can be a really cool reason to play the Pocket Edition over another edition, or at least, you know, give it some unique feeling to it. Uh, I really think these should be on all consoles, and this is a feature I love as someone who loves abandoned mine shafts. So, uh, basically, yeah, there's going to be above ground abandoned mine shafts. Uh, besides that, we've only seen screenshots of the Windows Phone version, and also of the lighting being fixed in this screenshot from Johan Berhardson. So, it looks like Minecraft is coming to Windows Phone, which isn't a bad thing for anyone, and it's a good thing for, you know, the people that are using it, so that's good news. And it also looks looks like 0.10.0 is slowly going along. It's going to be delayed because of, you know, the aforementioned uh, Windows Phone. But the above ground mineshaft thing looks awesome. The uh, lighting fixes, boats, uh, potentially lots of other really cool features. It's going to be an update to look forward to. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm sorry this is like three news videos in a row. For uh, later today, I've got Q&A SAS Day, which should be pretty good. And tomorrow, I'm going to be using another feature preview for 1.6.4. One of the cooler features, the stained uh, clay, in my opinion. So yeah, that's what's going to be going on there. Please do like the video if you liked it, if you're looking forward to Windows Phone, let me know. If you're just upset that it's being delayed, let me know too. I'm curious as to know where the general opinion is. Thank you for watching, and here is an outro.